week and we're going for that seven today. And I want to make sure I don't get his front tires in the water. track channel Gary grabbed me and said hey here's your microphone you know what to do because I've been on here the last couple of days and I appreciate you guys kind of tuning in and checking that out if you join a little bit of this commentary and some of the stuff that's been happening on Freedom Plus you can see more of me Adam Dory D-O-R-E-Y on YouTube and I've got a podcast it's called That's Cool Drink and it's all drag and drive based it's only drag and drive racers and co-pilots and all sorts of stuff like that I'm about 50 people in. I've gathered a couple other folks, so I've got a bunch of people I'm coming up very, very soon. I'm off next week, and then I'm gonna be at Rocky Mountain Race Week in two weeks, so tune into that. That'll be on Bang Shift. You can see plenty more of that. But the task at hand right now, we're at Six Summer. It's day number five. As cars are breaking the beams, they are finishing Six Summer. And finishing one of these things is absolutely winning one of these things. A lot of folks are actually winning, winning, but a lot of folks are just breaking the beams because they have injured cars, they've had all kinds of problems, and guys coming into the beams right now trying to make their passes. These are folks that were from quarantine. Quarantine gets an express lane into the, uh, into the track here, so they leave quarantine, come into this number one lane, and we're right in their way, and I apologize for that. But 
Guys, thanks so much for tuning into that track channel. Thanks so much to Gary for bringing you guys a little extra perspective from this. And I was able to watch the uh, the deal from uh, day number three at Earlville. And man, your uh, all your stuff is so so good. I appreciate it a lot. And on top of that, if you didn't see, 1320 is hanging out next to this guy and dapping him up as well. So pay attention to this channel. There's lots of cool stuff coming up. Hey guys, this is Mike Narks with my co-host and uh, right-hand man, Eric White. We're here at Byron Drag Week for day five of six summer. This has been a crazy week, dude. Yeah, for sure. We just saw a car dump all of its intercooler water out there. So we're getting a break right now. Got to go talk to some cars in the lanes. I hope you enjoy the video. The last day of six summer is here and uh, there's going to be a lot of action going on, but not as much as the other days. And reason for that is I actually have another event to attend tomorrow in Minnesota. So I have a seven or eight hour drive to get to another track for tomorrow for a completely different event uh, called Cash at the Creek. We're going to go check out. So if you're into no prep racing, make sure to check that out on the channel. Uh, so today's video isn't going to be as highly edited as some of the other stuff, just because I don't have the time in my schedule to uh, get it all done. Just running out of time. It's been a tough week, uh, but we've had a lot of fun doing it and we appreciate you guys all tuning in and supporting the channel. But let's get back to that action. We got that mean, mean stick shift Mustang in the left lane of Bob Gruber, Team Bob Racing. GT500 here in the right lane. Now Bob yesterday ran an 856 uh, at Great Lakes Dragway and I guess they're hoping to get dialed in as close to 850 as they can. Spun the tires off the line. 131 mile an hour. GG 500 going 1007, 143. 1022 for the Nova, 136 mile an hour.
driving that thing. 714, 210 mile an hour. My name's Kevin Robertson. I'm the owner of Byron Dragway here in Byron, Illinois, just outside of Rockford, if you're not familiar. This is day five of the best drag and drive we were gonna see all summer, six summer, 2024. It's been great having the crew all week. We were the start and the end of this week. We've been blessed with beautiful weather and great times, great racers, a lot of great solid competition. If you're ever in the Byron area, Stop on by, come check out some of our events. We love having not just Drag and Drive, but any other racing community. We're here to put on a show for the spectators and send you going with smiles on your faces. Thanks a lot, Six Summer 2024.